never been a fan of carrot salads. In fact, I absolutely hate them. Those wet shreds of carrots tossed with sweet raisins and doused in mayonnaise. Yuck. So when Becky started talking about this new carrot salad that she thought was terrific, I was intrigued. It really is a groundbreaking recipe. Okay. And I promise there's gonna be nothing damp or clumpy about it. Okay. okay you're gonna love it, I'm so excited. <laughs> so we're gonna start with the dressing. Really simple, we have a quarter cup of olive oil. We'll add a third of a cup of fresh orange juice. Okay, a little bit of sweetness. Yep, two tablespoons of white wine vinegar. And now just a tablespoon of honey, not too much again. <laughs> and there's no mayo. <laughs> no mayo is a good start. You trust me, right? I totally trust All you. Right. Quarter teaspoon of orange zest. Okay. Teaspoon of salt and half teaspoon of pepper. All right, so right off the bat, it's a vinaigrette, not a mayo-based dressing. Right, so we're off to a really good start, right? Yeah, well, that's different right away. Yes, this is really fresh, really bright. I think we're also gonna set a record today with the fastest recipe that we've ever done oh, really? on the show. We're gonna be done in five minutes here, oh, all right? That's my kind of thing. All right, so our dressing can hang out for a minute. Okay. And now we're gonna move over to the food processor. I have three quarters of a cup of blanched hazelnuts that we toasted in the oven for a little while. And if you can't find the blanch type, you can go ahead and toast them with the skins on and then just rub those skins off with a towel. Okay. And it's okay if some skins remain on there. So we'll chop these up in the food processor. 10 to 12 pulses here. Okay, so let's take the nuts out. Oh, that smells good. Oh, I know. Toasting the nuts really brings out their, their oils and their yep. flavors. Yeah. All right, so I'm putting that right back on the stand here. You don't need to wash out the bowl or anything. And now we have some fennel that we're going to chop mm. up. There's no crazy chopping here. We just need to get this broken down a little bit. So I'm just removing the core there, that little triangle piece. Mm -hmm. Just a tiny bit tough, so we'll take that out. And then we'll just chop this into one inch pieces. Put that in. Doesn't need to be perfect at all. All right, 10 to 12 pulses with the fennel. All right, so you can see that's pretty fine. Mm -hmm. This salad is actually fun to eat. The textures are really interesting. And now, believe it or not, we're almost done. We just have one more thing to chop. All right, you're winning me over with speed here. That's okay, for sure. Okay, great. What we're going to do is we're gonna just chop the carrots in the food processor. Ah. We're gonna get this really fine, fluffy texture that's kind of like tabbouleh. This is a pound of carrots. If you can, you wanna try and find the carrots with their green tops attached like this. So this is really simple. Just trim off these carrot tops. Now, here. do you use these for anything? You can, you can make pesto out of them. You can chop them up and put them in salads, kind of like an herb. Mm -hmm. Well, I know you're good about using every into your vegetable. That's right, so we don't want to waste those, so I'll put these in my purse for later. <laughs> <laughs> no one throw those away. Okay, and now we'll just chop these guys up. You're leaving the skins on. I know, isn't that awesome? You don't even have to peel them. Oh my goodness. In most recipes, we find that the skins are a little bit tough and they have a, a slight bitterness. Yeah. But we actually like that in this recipe. It's counteracted by the honey and the little bit of sweetness that oh. I put in. And then you, you end up with this perfect balance. Interesting. So now we'll just take our pound of carrots and I'm just gonna chop them into one inch pieces. This just makes them process evenly in the food processor. All right, so that's one pound of carrots without the tops. Gotcha. So now we want to grind these up. It's going to take 10 to 20 seconds, and we're looking for a tabbouleh-like texture. Into the bowl. So those are a bit finer than the fennel. Yes, that really looks like tabbouleh, right? Oh, it does. OK, so now I have a quarter cup of minced chives. And this is one thing you don't want to chop in the food processor. It'll just turn all green and muddy. So we chop these by hand. Mmm, pretty. All right, and now we'll add half of our hazelnuts and our dressing. Wow. With the honey and the orange. Mm. See how all these flavors are gonna come together? Well, what's got me right away is the texture of the carrots. This seems good. I mean, when have you ever had a carrot salad like this? Never. I know. Never. All right, let's get this in the serving bowl. Okay, now I have another quarter cup of minced chives here. Put those on. And the last of our hazelnuts. Ooh. Ooh. All right, what do you think about that? I think this is not like a carrot salad I've ever had before. And you don't have to let this sit and let the flavors melt. You can eat it right away. It's ready to go. Not bad for five minutes work. Mm-mm. Mm. I can't believe I've been missing this my whole life. Mm-hmm. That is really good. It's crunchy, but there's you, you said the texture, so I was paying attention. Mm-hmm. 
the texture of the carrots is slightly different than the fennel, than the nuts. And it's that trio of textures makes it fun. You said fun, and I thought you were kidding, but this is a fun salad. It really is good. You, the, mm -hmm. the toasted hazelnuts and the orange, mm. the freshness from the chive. Becky, I am blown away. Blown away that I would actually like a carrot salad this much. This is gonna knock the socks off guests because it's so unusual and so delicious. Yes. I hope you invite me to your party. <laughs> <laughs> so there you have it. Carrot salads have gotten a makeover. To make this, start with a simple dressing made with olive oil, white wine vinegar, and some orange zest. Leave the peels on the carrots and use a food processor to chop them into small pieces. To finish, toss in some chopped fennel, toasted hazelnuts, and sprinkle with chives. So from America's Test Kitchen to your kitchen, a surprising new recipe for chopped carrot salad with fennel, orange, and hazelnuts. I'm in. Thanks for watching America's Test Kitchen. What'd you think? Well, leave a comment and let us know which recipes you're excited to make, or you can just say hello. You can find links to today's recipes and reviews in the video description. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you later. I'll see you later. <laughs>